Hi, it's Tony here again from the Think to Thrive team. A video for you for your inspiration and motivation during this challenging time. How are you doing? We're shortly going to be uh, met with Mike Hendricks, my good friend. But today's video, you may notice again, we're outside this glorious weather. I want to share some facts with you just to empower you during this time so that when you do go outside, you'll just reinforce the idea that that's a a good thing to do in a safe, responsible way, of course, in terms of maintaining that strong mental focus and health. Now, I've been doing a bit of research. I'm lucky in that I do have a wonderful view and I can get into my garden. But just check out these, these, uh, these facts. When we look into the distance and we have a perspective or a view, that actually is really, really good for a feel-good factor. So when we look into the distance, we look at something that's a long, long way away, out from our window in our house, that's going to reinforce that feel-good chemical inside the brain, that sense of purpose. When we listen to sounds, we, we, hit, we can smell uh, plants, we can garden, we can touch leaves and, and work in the garden in that way, into, in just working around our house in our immediate environment that process is actually going to increase a sense of appreciation and mindfulness. Textures, smells, what you see, what you smell, that's actually going to calm you down. Colours are very, very important. Now, if you're feeling a bit anxious at the moment, lavender, a calm lavender colour, blue, really, really good to keep that calm mental focus. Orange is a great colour for passion and drive and energy. So when you think about the plants that are in your house or your gardening, think about how powerful colour can be as well in terms of keeping that mental focus. So get outdoors into that safe environment of your garden, spend time with nature. It's going to help your mental focus and well-being. It's obvious I found those three facts really interesting this morning when I was researching. Over to Mike now, who's going to elaborate a little bit more about his take on this, the power of nature for your well-being. This is Tony Mallet signing out. So it's quite simple, really. Do your best to stimulate your senses. Get outside. Get in amongst na nature. Walk in the woods. Smell the plants in the garden. Stimulate and arouse our senses that maybe you haven't done for a period of time. Touch things that you haven't touched before your fingers in the dirt. If you can't get outside, maybe get amongst your plants in your house. Smell them. Be at one with nature because nature nothing offers nothing but positive and empowering energy. And that's what we need right now, to be empowered, to be uplifted, to feel at one, to feel relaxed. Nature has a power of doing that for you. So, stimulate those senses. Get outside. Do what you can and that'll help you to relax. Until next time, Take care, be energized, all the best.